meow meow my soul tribe so in this uh, general reading because we are all learning with spirit guys spirit guys 101 but before i'm going to speak let's call spirit guys because i'm picking up something about past lives someone from your past so i'm not showing my face today because i am recording this reading but regardless you're going to see me channel the energy is right in front of you as close as it can get so calling on my spirit guides my guardian angel the assistance of the higher power and the spirit of the universe as we're going to channel messages possible energies advice for twin flame and soulmate love connection today tomorrow timeless for whoever needs to hear this message thank you spirit guides and guardian angel guidance please so guys the reason why i i try to record this because I just took a shower and then I said I cleansed myself you know as divine feminists were too um you know we, we are we have our own ritual cleansing anyways kitty cat is just water very old-fashioned so anyways what I'm picking up on spirit guy says someone from the past something about the past or is something like past lives or maybe someone from your past is returning in your life it could be closure it could be unfinished business maybe they're going to stay and or i was also picking up a reunion so anyways let's let's go forward because that's that's it spirit guys i was one of saying like you know reunion life mission life purpose and be stable be balanced so you know what possibility my soul try because we are extreme what we're going to see today something about the community three of pentacles six of pentacles because living your life purpose your life mission to give and receive to share what you have to others um th th this is the journey is all about the life mission this is why you are here because you are a spiritual being having a human experience so never ever forget never ever stray that this journey is not just about union not about money but also your life purpose so maybe we're also going to see ace of pentacles six of cups ten of cups because spirit guy says someone from your past is coming back in your life could be twin flame or a soulmate connection so really oh my gosh judgment the world and chariot look guys i cannot believe what i am channeling right now so let's go spirit guys let's go because i want to understand so repeat oh my god i'm not even ready yet spirit guys the whole energy just flew as i was picking it up so anyways but before that we are going to like I'm trying to to prove to every one of you, my soul tribe, as close as it can get, is shuffling for a million times right in front of your eyes. So whoever doesn't believe, nothing I can do when I'm already trying to prove to you every time. But, you know, just for, just for the, this, uh, how do I say, just to prove it, just to prove it. Look at it, guys, when you... When you shuffle, you don't even control. Look at this. Like I said, nothing. Okay, so repeat what I say. What are we going to see today? Three of pentacles, six of pentacles, ace of pentacles, ten of cups. Maybe ten of pentacles as well. Or a six of cups, something or someone from your past. Judgment, the world, the chariot. I mean, in any order. Because I know that someone is coming in your life. Something about past lives. So let's understand, spirit guides. I am ready. Let's understand, please. On the table, please. I'm not ready, guys. I'm not ready, spirit guides. Two of wheels. Someone juggling. Okay, someone juggling. But I don't feel cold to, to get that. So sorry, guys. I don't feel cold to get that. It has to drop. Spirit guides has to drop. Oh, it really dropped on the floor. Seven of swords. Someone, someone hurt you from the past? What is this? Seven of swords is like deception. You know, the first energy, I did not took it because it's like two of pentacles, someone juggling. They want to come, they want to 
do something and, and what like it feels like if someone is watching you and researching about you what is this someone is curious about you someone who knows you already what is this and someone is like hiding behind the tree who is this but it's like a deceptive energy guys did i even tell you ace of wheels there you go ace of pentacles bam i mean tell you honestly guys what is going on here spirit guides guys remember i already tell you that what we're going to see today i didn't channel a lot as i always is every day but it's very consistent and the camera is close as it can get something about money stability balance or possibly this person someone from your past either you know this person or maybe it, it's part of your past lives or karmic karmic lives or some some something from your past it it could have happened in the past or possibly in this lifetime or something in your past lives this person needs to be strong for you so that's the reason why possibly in your past lives it didn't work because this person needs to be strong for you and and need to be stable for you or possibility maybe the one reason why they never chose you they never chose you maybe in this lifetime or you're in in your past lives because they they chose money that maybe that's what they maybe that's what they did because um but what is going on spirit guys something fell page of wands new beginning but it feels like this person wants to come in because really i'm already trying to tell you the storyline and the energy my soul tribe something that we don't understand someone from your past or past lives wants to come back in your life and it feels like wants to have a new beginning and and a chance to be with you and it feels like they are watching you they are contemplating their strategy but it feels like this person okay it, it's like what are their intentions towards you they want they want to come in will they stay or will they go so now this is the reason why i i did a reading because i wanted to learn but like i said what i channeled in here is already right in front of you my soul tribe so anyways seven of wheels seven 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 energy seven of pentacles that's someone someone shouldn't be hopeless when it comes to love someone shouldn't be hopeless when it comes to money because spirit is trying to say someone is like i could feel like someone was feeling hopeless but it feels like spirit guys says maybe maybe um your love story there's going to be an improvement in your love life oh my gosh maybe because someone is going to come but you have your law of free will my soul tribe if you want this person or not because i'm picking up on they started on the wrong foot long long time ago even if it's in past life six of swords six of swords spirit guys says learn forgiveness i am channeling reunion you gotta learn forgiveness you gotta forgive this person compromise passage let the past go heal the past that's how spirit guys want to to let you know my soul tribe five of wheels i know someone left someone there was some sadness and someone moved on but really since we are already advanced we already know that someone is coming back because someone is thinking did they ever did they ever made the right decision of leaving you or the or maybe if you're the one who left them behind now they are thinking they are thinking why did you left them or why did the why did the connection fall apart but the reason is there's unfinished business unfinished business my soul tribe so now hangman it's like someone is contemplating someone is thinking someone is in in a like really an, a contemplative mode some the hermit there you go guys that is exactly what i was trying to tell you contemplative someone goes to solitude right now someone is going back to or maybe but the hermit is like 
they're digging deeper within themselves that's why i was already channeling someone is thinking someone is thinking guys why you left them behind or why did they even let leave you so someone now is thinking what is this divine masculine divine masculine is is very pensive and contemplating like what did he do why did you leave him why did the connection why is the connection the fool the fool is like like someone wants to someone wants to to uh run towards you just really like like really like like just want to take risk coming forward towards you so anyways what is blocking this person what is blocking this person from coming towards you if that's the case because it feels like this person is thinking whatever happened in the connection and he knows that you know like he knows that maybe something wasn't right i guess that's the reason why there was a there was a breakup there was a separation or maybe it wasn't it wasn't the right the right time seven of cups yes there you go i i was asking already why what is what is blocking your connection because they were shopping around they were shopping around they thought it's the greener pastures on the other side they think that everything they think that you know they realize that not everything that glitters is gold okay because this is poor choices bad mistakes poor decisions uh picking the wrong choice if this is karmic they they pick the wrong connections and um guys spirit guys just um just answered us why did the connection didn't work out for you like let's say divine masculine divine feminine why why are you in separation because someone has to grow because someone went it's like if this is a horse they have to like focus look straight not look everywhere else so anyways there was some temptation there could be karmic there could be other priorities so now but this person this person whoever is very pensive right now is thinking about you and possibly also um they're also uh, burying themselves to with work or possibly they're working on themselves their balance trying to find their light trying to be mature and they're very stressed right now divine masculine is very very stressed that's how spirit guys what did i say guys three of pentacles this divine masculine is very stressed and and they cannot sleep at night they're feeling like they're feeling like heavy right now because they know that if they're the ones who did you wrong they are looking they are researching they are curious about you your connection is curious about you i already know that because that's what we are already picking up on someone you connected to which you know like if this is a twin flame journey you are in separation right now there you go someone wants to take action towards you possibility apology possibility reunion so good luck guys good luck let's see what what is spirit guys has to say i mean i <laughs> that's the reason why i'm there you go guys justice to give healing to to say sorry to make things right divine masculine wants to come forward and make things right in your life so possibly reunion guys possibly closure or possibly cutting away what no longer serves your connection it could be make or break guys this could be this could be a, a makeup or this could be a breakup so that's how i could channel right now but for some reason this person is really thinking about you so now it's like it's all about truth it's all about stability and balance and it feels like he's very mature so now let's clarify what they want with you a closure a reunion we'll pick it up i mean seriously spirit guy says that's the reason why but i was i was shunneled the chariot the world the ten of cups those are energies that someone wants to stay because their heart is with you there you go flow to the sea eternal love reunion 
Oh my gosh, that's deep feelings. And if someone was in balance, there's going to be balance and needing to flow and, and letting things naturally unfold and letting go of control. But regardless, this is the energy of the sea, loving each other as deep as the sea, remembering the promise to love each other as deep as the sea. So eternal love. But there was some challenges. We know that because there was temptation. Obviously, there was separation. But like I said already, guys, the love is always there. No matter what others going to be to be saying, we are supernatural, flexible. Someone needs to be flexible. Someone needs to embrace change. And I um I am really channeling forgiveness, guys. There you go. Forgiveness through all this chaos and conflict. There was some challenges. There was chaos and conflict. Possibly your connection wants to come forward towards you but he feel like he, that's the reason why i did not pick up the juggling the very first energy but this is someone's energy right now is is uh it's like very distorted energy scattered energy it feels like he want someone wants to say sorry and someone is looking at you someone wants to come forward but really, the King of Wands is here saying they will come forward. This connection will come forward. That no matter what, no matter what, through the chaos and the conflict, they're coming in. They're coming in. So now, this is very interesting, Spirit Guys. Whoever wants to hear this, for whoever is this energy, Spirit Guys, this someone wants to come back in your life. Bam. reunion natural beauty and authenticity be yourself as god made you naturally attractive and lovable inside and out so if this connection put you in the dark night of the soul if this connection ever made you um lose self-confidence your self-esteem or maybe if this connection whether in your past lives or here in this lifetime hurt you and gave you so much pain remember god wants to tell you that you are beautiful and and if you just awaken possibly divine feminine is is being called by the universe to ascend and awaken then you have to celebrate your difference and you have to walk your spiritual path embrace the spiritual path and you are beautiful okay so anyways that's how i'm picking up on in this energy but anyway let's clarify spirit guides prosperity there's a positive shift in your flow of divine support so anyways guys so maybe someone is praying someone is praying for an improvement in your love life so anyway spirit guys wanted to let you know that that there is there is improvement in your divine support so it could be spirit guys guardian angel going to send you signs or step up with your prayer and meditation and you need to heal what did i say i didn't even look at it when i say heal bam i put like that it's green guys spirit guys says you need to heal and you know the jade is the precious stone of the empress and the emperor someone needs to heal and need to learn forgiveness and embrace the spiritual path and oh my gosh and it's like believe that that the divine is going to help you in this connection and let yourself sparkle and shine you are guided to be bold and show your bigger than life side to the world so remember when i was already trying to tell you from from the very beginning that this connection is all about finding yourself finding your life living your life purpose you're serving your life mission and you know this reunion this twin flame this soulmate is just a bonus gift if you're going to have a reunion which we are also channeling right now then spirit guide says congratulations but in the end do not do not forget your life purpose as well so now Huh. Yeah, it's interesting energy right now. But if someone, if your connection that you connected to in the past wants to come back in your life, then that means, guys, if this is the one, if this person is the one, then that means they're on their way to you. 
they're on their way to you but someone really needs to heal because it's saying in here run wild for a while someone need needs to dig deeper but we know because we are picking up on the hermit energy a while ago so possibly this is this is the energy of your connection or this person right now is contemplating <laughs> trying to plan their strategy how to come back in your life be the powerful space between opposite poles but spirit guys trying to say you are much more smarter now you need to make smarter decision like really look at this you gotta learn to love and respect yourself you are your own temple so whatever you like if th this is what i i can channel right now that whatever mistakes whatever it's like poor choices poor mistake remember that you're going to pay the consequences so you so spirit guys says be the power powerful space between opposite poles because you need you need to uh make smarter decision and something about you know like someone holding like the ace of cups is so so that means like you are blessed and you know better you need the divine guidance and divine intervention or call spirit guides and guardian angel to help you to help you make smarter decisions if you want to be to if you want this person back in your life or not so anyways you are cherished and protected i was just saying guys that you need divine intervention so anyways spirit guys trying to tell you maybe choose yourself earth rapture you are cherished and protected whatever you decide whatever you decide spirit guys want to let you know you are cherished and protected you are your own temple maybe take care of you right now take care of yourself choose yourself if this person truly wants to come forward in your life let them let them but they have to to prove themselves to you so this energy is very very interesting so that's the reason why i try to understand and record it explore other options <gasps> explore other realms explore other realms that means someone is ascending voyage of Meldun. it's like embrace the journey explore other realms it means like choose yourself choose peace choose harmony or or that's what i was already trying to say walk the spiritual path walk the spiritual path because you need to find your light so it feels like spirit guys really trying to say right now do not be so focused on union although someone wants to to come in your life if they want to be if they want to to stay and love you forever fine okay but some something about your life purpose like about your your spiritual life mission why you are here on earth i'm going to um i'm going that's it that's it spirit guys thank you adapt to a new situation so it feels like it's time to move on a new direction so maybe this is what spirit guys is trying to say as my soul tribe uh, that you know you gotta choose yourself you gotta embrace change although i was also channeling the world a while ago maybe someone went through the dark night of the soul but really this is an advice from spirit guys that if this person just in case someone from your past in this lifetime is really coming back in your life you gotta you gotta make smarter decisions if this person has good intention towards you remember remember maybe they started off in a very deceptive deceptive behavior and then they weren't they they have a problem with money and and they want they want a future with you, a new beginning, but something about immaturity because we are seeing the Seven of Cups. But anyways, what is this spirit, guys? Feels like spirit guys trying to say, make smarter decisions. So anyway, but in the end, you got to choose yourself. But if you really wanted to be with this person, what is stopping you? But this person needs to be mature because you don't want you don't want to put them back in your life and then they're going to lead you on again and then they're going to like you know like 
go shop around again oh my god there you go illuminate the shadow uh, that's why i was already trying to tell you my soul tribe you know how amazing is it like focus on the solution so spirit guys trying to say be careful be careful of someone leading you on you know my you know as much as i want to say there is reunion possibility there is you reunion but really spirit guys trying to say learn from your mistakes illuminate the shadow learn from the darkness learn from the past because this person doesn't mean to say that they come from the past that they already changed <laughs> they might they possibly like like what is that like wearing how how it's like a wearing a facade again to lead you on but anyways it feels also like a twin flame journey my soul tribe it's like the trigger on and off on and off they want to be with you and then they're not sure and then they want to be with you so it's like the trigger so anyway what is this spirit guys i don't, this is insane spirit guys wanted to say that let go of fear choose faith over fear divine will like like divine will is like what will be will be and and call divine intervention because if you really want to be with this person no one is going to stop you you will choose regardless even though there was a lot of darkness but spirit guys is just trying to warn you that there you go spirit guys wanted to let you know that you're an awakened soul now or possibly spirit guys and guardian angel is already trying to give you guidance so you might have to follow your instincts and your gut feeling that you know if 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 this person came back in your life and then is saying yes then follow your your instinct but if you're thinking like no then no okay because spirit guys wanted to let you know desire to change desire to change which we are also channeling adapt to a new situation which means it's time to move on a new direction so my soul tribe maybe spirit guys trying to tell you be careful of this person coming back in your life i think we also channel that i remember this energy like i think it was last week it's like beware of one-sided connection or something you know something about like our spirit guys sometimes we don't understand guys but you know it's just interesting to listen so i have to try i have to try guys but really spirit guys says remember do not stray on the path remember your spiritual path in the end choose yourself choose peace choose faith over fear like if really if truly if if this person will really prove that they love you very much then no one is going to stop them but they have to prove themselves because if they're not have good intentions towards you the universe is going to cut them away from your life trust your instincts trust your instincts what did i say guys i mean i have to you can, oh my god i was just saying those guys trust your instincts what is your instincts telling you do you want this person back in your life or is there a red flag there you go trust your instincts sometimes i don't understand guys but this is very good speaking to us right now transform and unveil your gifts because you have to embrace yourself remember that you're gifted you are blessed you have to learn more about yourself about your journey so maybe when you learn about yourself when you meet your higher self then you will truly know who is the right one for you and you're going to manifest your true love and happily ever after that's the reason why sometimes we have to meet spirit guys guardian angel your higher self and and establish your your alignment and connection with the mother universe and father up above so you will manifest your true connection in your life take care of your needs guys this energy doesn't play choose yourself that's what spirit guys says it's time to move on a new direction if this person if whoever's coming back from your past doesn't have the best intention towards you so guys i can only try okay i can only try so you know i almost channeled while ago that 
you know, when I say that someone is wearing a facade, it feels like I am seeing like someone, it's like he's a sheep wearing a wolf's clothing or maybe a wolf wearing a sheep's clothing. They're very deceptive, guys. You know, someone needs to hear this. And, you know, like I could feel like dark energy that this person couldn't be trusted. So maybe Spirit is really trying to tell you to it's time to move on a new direction. You have to trust your instincts. Whatever your instincts is trying to tell you, then do not entertain others unless they prove themselves worthy of your love and attention. So, wow, we can try. We can try. So now what is the red card, Spirit Guides? Maybe one red card, just so we can understand celebration. Anyway, Spirit Guides is trying to say that you know, you got to look forward in the future that you're going to be happy. You cannot be settling for less, especially if Spirit Guys is trying to warn you about red flags. So anyways, huh, now, it's like, yeah, heal. Spirit Guys says you got to heal. You got to heal, which we already channeled a while ago. Forgiveness, you know, maybe if this person hurt you from the past, you learn forgiveness. You need to heal, but you gotta trust your instincts. What is what are their intention towards you? If if this person wants to be with you and they prove their their love to you, someone wants someone needs to prove their worth or their love to you. But if they don't have the best intentions, then spirit guy says gotta let them go, forgive them, but you gotta let them go. So anyway, some energy sometimes, guys. Oh my God, I just saw judgment. Someone from your past coming back in your life. It fell over there, my soul tribe. But anyways, judgment is like, you will move on from this. The pain will pass. Like there's going to be judgment. There's going to be victory and success. You're going to heal from all this. There's going to be closure. So anyways, but if this person truly, truly disprove themselves to you, then why not but it's your instincts follow your instincts trust your instincts honor and trust your intuition oh my god exactly what spirit guys is trying to say guys you know all this energy right now is not made up guys because look at this again what is your feelings trying to tell you you know the answer your instincts will tell you or or spirit guys and guardian angels your gut feeling guys i'm getting goosebumps right now Thank you, Archangel Michael, for supporting, guiding, and protecting us as we listen to and act upon our feelings. Help us understand and express our emotions with love. So, guys, enough said. You know, this is like it could explain itself. Honor and trust your intuition. Trust your in instincts. What are your instincts trying to tell you? And look at this, guys. Oh, my God. It's also about instincts again. This is not a coincidence. Your inner guidance is real and trustworthy. And really, Spirit Guides is really trying to tell you. Whoever needs to hear this, trust your instincts. Trust your intuition. You are right. If you're feeling like something is off with this person or someone coming back in your life, trying to cause havoc into your life or your emotions then spirit guide says do not welcome do not welcome this unhealthy behavior in your life whether this could be friendship this could be relationship so oh my gosh guys back to back to back saying honor and trust your feelings trust your intuition trust your instincts and then lastly your inner your inner guidance is real and trustworthy Oh my gosh, guys, something. There's a message here. There's a message here for whoever needs to hear this. Please help us clearly hear, see, feel, and know the divine guidance that we have asked and prayed for. Allow us to keep our ego out of the way so your wisdom can come streaming through us for our own benefit and for those around us. So this message is for someone who needs to hear this if you're seeking answers if you're in the situation that someone from your past is coming back in your life so spirit guys trying to tell you trust your intuition honor your instincts how do you feel about this person if this person doesn't have good intention about you then do not do not accept them back in your life because it's toxic it's unhealthy and there's immaturity and you don't want to be 
falling on the black hole like Alice in Wonderland. So guys, this is the reading today, the energy. Someone needs to trust their intuition, trust your instincts, or, or really, if someone from your past is coming back in your life, someone needs to prove their worth and someone needs to prove their love to you. But anyways, really, I am channeling guys that you got to move on in a new direction if ever. Okay, if you feel like red flag because it's in the end, you know, you know the answer. Your intuition will tell you if you want this situation or person in your life or not. So until then, thank you. Bye.